artifact allies, today's artifact is a replica butter churn. This butter churn in particular is from our education collection, and it's a great hands-on tool for demonstrating processes of the past. Our artifact is a staff or plunger butter churn. It is a small tabletop version. It is lightweight and made of wood. The churn features a staff known as the dash, plumber, or churn staff, among other names. The churn staff is used to agitate the cream to create butter. Churning butter in a clean and cool environment is of the utmost importance. All tools should be sanitized with scalding hot water. Raw milk is best strained and allowed to settle at room temperature in setting dishes. Cream should be removed from the top of the dishes and the buttermilk set aside. The strained cream is poured into a clean churn. It is important to get a bit of height to aerate the cream as best possible. The cap is placed on top and the motion commences. There needs to be a calm, consistent up and down movement created, incorporating a twist on the downward stroke. If one works too quickly, the butter will be created faster at the cost of losing fat to the buttermilk. At about 25 minutes, the butter starts to separate. It starts to form a ball at the bottom of the churn. It will be at least 10 minutes before the butter is ready for the next step. Next, the butter is scraped out of the churn and placed into cheesecloth. The butter can be wrung out and the buttermilk collected below. The butter needs to be washed three to four times to ensure the removal of buttermilk. The butter can be salted for taste and preservation. Herbs can also be added at this time. The finished butter can then be pressed into molds or shaped with wooden paddles. The time it takes to churn butter can range from 30 minutes all the way up to an hour.